in the omatidum of drosophila first of all the r8 cell develops r2 and r5 cells then develop r3 and r4 cells then develop r1 and r6 cells then develop at last r7 cell develops the r1 r2 r3 r4 r5 r6 r7 r8 cells are called as photoreceptor cells the function of r7 photoreceptor cell is to detect ultraviolet light the r8 cell surface has a protein called as bos the r7 precursor cell surface has a protein called as sab rtk in its inactive form during the development of r7 cell the bos protein first of all binds to the sab rtk so here we can say that the bos protein acts as a ligand for sab rtk the sab rtk then phosphorylates itself on tyrosines due to this phosphorylation the sab rtk becomes active the sh2 domain on the adapter protein drk then binds to a specific phosphorylated tyrosine on the active sab rtk the adapter protein drk has two sh3 domains the ras gef also called as sos then binds to the two sh3 domains on the adapter protein drk due to this binding the ras gef or sos becomes active the active ras gef or sos then stimulates ras protein the ras protein is present in its inactive form with a bound gdp due to this stimulation the inactive ras protein replaces its bound gdp with gtp due to this gtp binding the inactive ras protein undergoes a conformational change due to this conformational change the inactive ras protein becomes active the active ras protein then causes downstream signals these downstream signals induce the r7 precursor cell to differentiate into a uv sensing photoreceptor cell please like subscribe and share